Yeah, product-led marketing, especially for a, an audience that is not too keen to get on the phone with a salesperson, I imagine. Yeah, and uh, you're not, right, cases like pretty large enterprises where like, uh, like uh, I, I don't think I'm allowed to name them because we haven't closed the deal yet, but yeah, I mean, they, uh, like CTOs and, 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 and so on in those orgs, like they have set up an account with their personal email. They have kicked the tires, see if it is worth, worth uh, a shot. And then they kind of reached out to us and in the first sales call with, which we had with them, there were like 11 people on their side. So they're already sold, like the product already sold. So, I mean, like yeah. now it's mostly about the commercials and running a POC and all that stuff, like uh, MSA. So mm -hmm. the, having a free tier is super important when you're selling, uh, like when you have this like bottoms up uh, developer first targeting. Absolutely. Uh, Adam Gross, uh, I, I don't know if you know him, like he, he used to be the CEO of Heroku uh, as VP at Salesforce. And he has this framework called 123 framework of like selling to developers. So uh, it's, a, it's a great uh, read. So yeah. What, can you can you walk us quickly through that 123 framework? I'm not familiar uh, with it. It's kind of like how you, how you sell to like companies like that, right? So you start with like uh, developers uh, like uh, at the bottom. and. So like he kind of contrasts like the traditional sales versus like the bottom sub sales, right? And the traditional sales was very much top down. You go and like uh, have dinner with the, the the exec and the, the CIO or CTO, and then you sell it to sell to him first. And then that gets pushed to the, the actual users. So that was the traditional way of selling. The, the new age uh, selling, particularly to developers is like you, you first sell to the developers uh, bot bottoms up, like uh, they kind of use the free tier product. Then you kind of upgrade them to the paid product and then you layer on sales on top, right? So who can go and pitch to uh, like the, the other teams in the company.